been on top of the sniper meta for a very long time time and finally it has been dethroned as king since the new update from the 19th of may there was a big buff in the sniper rifles in call of duty warzone the lw3 had a buff the barrett 50 cal had a buff the zrg had a buff and of course the swiss k31 had a big buff hence the reason why i'm making this video so if you're not 100 percent sure on what got buffed and what changed inside the sniper rifles i'll just put a screenshot up on the screen so you can read it for yourself because i'm pretty sure you've seen it elsewhere or you've seen it on jay god's video so uh yeah this Swiss K31 is by far the best alternative to the Car 98, which was on top of the sniper game for a long time. It actually has a faster ADS speed than the Car 98, and it was increased more in the patch notes. It pretty much has the same feel as the Car 98, it's just lighter, faster, and a lot easier to use. The bullet velocity is pretty much exactly the same as well if you put the combat recon barrel on it. I don't know why, but it's just so satisfying to get a kill with a Swiss, Swiss K31. It's just, it's just, it's, I can't explain it. It just feels so good to hit a headshot with. I don't know why it just does. But as the saying goes, we don't fuck about around here. On the rear grip, use this speed tape personal preference you can change it if you want but on all of my sniper rifles literally on every single one i always use the first speed grip that you unlock i just don't like to sacrifice anything for an increase in ads speed then on the underbarrel use the bruiser grip this for me is a must for aggressive players because it allows for more movement speed and uh, aiming stability when you're aiming down sights so it's an absolute must then use the 24.9 inch combat recon barrel again an absolute must on this weapon because i'm not gonna lie when i didn't have this unlocked the bullet velocity was awful so this is a 100 percent you need this on the gun. Then use the SWAT 5 laser sight. Then on the muzzle, use the sound moderator. This increases the ADS speed, the bullet velocity, the sprint to fire speed, and then it also has sound suppression as well, which is, an app, which is obvious. I mean, as long as you're getting headshots with it, it doesn't really matter whether you use the GIU suppressor or not. I have a 33.91 headshot percentage, which is actually very, very high. So I might even use this instead of the GIU suppressor into the future. And uh, that's pretty much it. See you later.